infraspinatus. The patient is in the lateral decubitus position with the side to be studied superior. The scapular spine is identified and the midpoint determined and the needle is inserted approximately three to four centimeters or two finger breadths inferior to that midpoint. The infraspinatus is deep to the trapezius therefore the electrode tip should be advanced to the surface of the scapula very gently and then slightly withdrawn before recording. Activation is made by slightly externally rotating the shoulder. Observe the movement of the forearm. Occasionally patients cannot relax the muscle enough to assess spontaneous activity. Relaxation of this muscle can be achieved by resting the arm along their side or the use of what this author calls the sweetheart pillow which I've already placed in front along the patient's abdomen which allows greater relaxation as they allow their arm to hang down over it.